All right, so here's a, a quick how-to on how to work with a MoFi 4500. We're gonna unbox it, we're gonna set it up and show you how to uh, either change out or uh, do a new installation of a SIM card. So the first thing on here, you have a couple of notes that come in here from, from MoFi, including instructions on how to actually change out the, uh, the SIM card on there. Um, you have a couple of different uh, hardware things in here as well. Um, so these are the high gain paddle antennas. So we'll open one of these things up. This is the actual modem itself. Take it out of the bag. Now on the modem itself, you have uh, two different sets of SMA antenna plugins. So the first one here, uh, it'll show primary and secondary 4G, uh, 3G, 4G LTE antenna. Um, so this is where these high gain and paddle antennas are going to screw on. You just put them on like so. And you'll do that on both sides. Uh, it comes with, with two of them. The next one here is a 2.4 gigahertz uh, Wi-Fi antenna. So this is in use if you are also using this as your Wi-Fi router. Um, so some folks do, some folks don't. Um, if you have any questions about that, you can always consult us about it. You also have your power adapter and a short Cat5 cable. Those are going to plug in on the back side here. Um, so you'll plug in power right here. A, uh, you have a, a reset button right here, and then these are four LAN ports. Now this blue WAN port here uh, is generally not going to be used by most of our customers. However, if this is being used as a uh, internet backup solution, for instance, for a business, you, you could plug in a, uh, like a, a cable modem into that, and this would be able to use both LTE and cable. Now on the front side here, you have uh, a couple different ports. You have a USB port and then a, a micro SD memory card slot. These are also almost never going to be used. That's not a, not a function that most of our customer, customers do use. What most of our customers need is the SIM card slot. So if you go in right here, it is labeled SIM. And you'll also see a diagram here on how to install the proper orientation for that, for that SIM card slot. Um, so there are actually two different sizes of SIM cards. You have a full-size SIM card, which looks like this, and then you have what's called a micro SD card, which looks like this. Uh, different models of modems will utilize different sizes of SIM cards, which is also why they come with a uh, SIM card adapter kit in there as well. So if uh, you're upgrading from a different model that was using the micro SD SIM, uh, the, actual, the actual SIM, you know, the large size, um, is what's used on the MoFi itself. So you have an adapter here, which you can open up and pull out the proper size for it. And that SIM card will fit on the inside of that notch. So you put it in like that. You wanna make sure that it's not loose in there at all. So you may wanna take uh, something hard and make sure that it, it's fit it in there properly. Um, it, you will see it's just a little bit larger, it's a little bit thicker than the SIM adapter itself, and that's okay. So when you do insert it in there, once again, you have this diagram that shows you exactly how it's supposed to be working. Um, so the, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that these pins, this metal part is facing uh, up, and you're going to place it in with the notch facing in. You'll put it in like that, and you'll be able to feel it click in. There will be about an eighth of an inch that's actually hanging out, um, so don't be concerned that it didn't eat the whole thing in there. And any time that you wanna pull it out again, you just push it in, it releases, and you can pull that SIM card out. Now the same thing applies with a micro, micro uh, SIM adapter. You can go through there, once again, pins up, notch in, and put it through. Now it is important to note that generally there's still a little bit of adhesive on there from, from the uh, little kit that you pulled it out of. So it may, might be a little bit sticky and it might not feel as clean as if it was uh, the actual SIM card itself, um, you know, the full size SIM card. However, it is still in there and it, you'll also be able to see it sticking out just a little bit. Same thing applies. If you wanna pull it out, push it in, it will release and there you go. 
So it's that simple. Uh, you What you do not want, you do not want to put it in backwards like this. You don't want to put it in with pins facing down. You don't want to do any of that. Once again, pins up, notch facing in, push it in, and you're good to go.